from that to yeah. that. Dad, yeah. I have never ever said no to you on anything before. But this, it's a no for me. Your decisions and arrangement does not go well with my person. I'm sorry, I can't. No. You can. And you will. Yes. Dad. Yes. You're taking this way too far. There is no way that I am going to agree to something that I know will make my life miserable. Come on, Cynthia. Of course.
my parents have always told me that someday our families will live more on the common ground as standards. So I I believe that someday I think it's going to be my wife someday. It's, it's rather disheartening that things turned out this way. Please, I, I want to beg the good families to just respect her feelings. Let her be. Please. Oh my goodness. I'm enlightening the way Ben, my nephew, just spoke. I, I want to beg you, allow your daughter to make her decisions. We have established good relationships. And I wouldn't want us to end it in a disastrous way. Please, I beg you. If it is the will of God that they are going to be together as we want, I know nothing will stop it. Alright, so shall we leave? Uh, would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Sing for me. Would you give me a kiss? Good morning. Hi, I'm okay. You look far different from what I expected. Like, what happened yesterday? I thought the devil was going to let loose. <laughs> well, let's just say that, you know, the table turned out in my favor. You mean the Rogers are mad at you? Ironically, no. Well, according to that, he said that um, the roads, especially Ben, respected my feelings and decisions and that I should be left alone. So, hey. Wow, wow, wow. Can wow. you stop? Wow, 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 wow. You sound like a siren. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Thank you, my dear. I am so happy for me. Oh, just imagine. It's a he called to tell me of how wonderful you were. And he can't wait to work with you. I also can't wait for you to work with him. <laughs> but why did you tell him you were my daughter? Dad, because I wanted it based on merits. Yes, and this also goes a long way to talk about my philosophy about life. Mm. And that is why I need a relationship with a man who's got great potential, self made, rather than someone who leverages on his father's affluence and influence. That's right. And with this philosophy, you will go far. Of course, you'll gain success. She will get a car gift. Yeah. Daddy, <laughs> two cars. Three. You haven't achieved until you Shush! Sure. Right. <laughs> Did you hear me, Daddy? Achieve! Achieve! Go ahead. I, I will. <laughs> Dad, mom, uh, yeah? let me tell you a secret. Uh, She's planning a birthday party at the club with the friends. I'm really? going. You beware. You don't go anywhere. That's the secret. And it's a know, secret. You're supposed to You always it. know Cindy. Yes! Secrets. Of course. She's my dear sister. Is she? Mm.
not wish you a happy birthday. Oh, oh my god. Thank you. I actually forgot. <laughs> it's my birthday. Yeah. So now tell me, any plans for this celebration? Well, nothing really, but maybe um, we'll just meet at the club as usual. Wow, okay. See you later then. Alright, now see you later.
tell you. It's all right, my love. I'll see you later. Love you. Yeah. Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Will you sing for me? Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Baby, smile for me. Me want love you. Me want love you. Me want kiss your body. Me want touch you. Pat, what do you actually think you're doing? Picking that green hair. Picking that green hair. Are you the one that's supposed to be doing that? Oh, I am the person that's supposed to be doing it. Mom, who is my daddy? Come on, really? Your daddy. Mm -hmm. oh, really? Uh, better, better get up from there. Mommy, you don't be jealous. What is it? Uh, don't be jealous, mommy. Oh, no way. Didn't I say? Oh, oh so God. soon. Yes, mommy. Oh, it's just a pity. Cynthia can't join us. Why, while I'm here? She has to attend to something urgently. Really? We have to eat dinner with them. Oh my God. I don't know. I apologize. I... I'm just really excited because I'm around you. You know, initially I was skeptical that you wouldn't give me a chance to be close to you and nice to you, considering your family status. Just for your love, I go do anyhow. Yeah. Let me touch your body, let me know you better. Let me hold your body. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Would you give me the kiss to your father? Yeah, Cynthia. Hi. I hear you are out with a friend. You sing for me. Bring him home. No problem. Let's have dinner tomorrow. Okay, I will. Okay, bye. Okay, you go ahead. Okay. Come after you. Yes, yeah. mommy. Yeah. Okay. So let's go. <sighs> Are you serious? Like he wants to meet me? Yeah. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> when does he want to see me? Well, as soon as possible. I'm very excited. Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? I am highly honored. Uh, it's time to know this young man that has stolen the heart of our angel. Yes. Well, my name is Adimola Adekunle. I am an orphan. One who survived by his skin of the teeth. But I do not entertain any pity because I do consider myself to be a survivor. I have a, I mean, I graduated with a first degree from Obafemiya World University in civil engineering. Mm -hmm. And then I went ahead to obtain my master's. 
Currently, I work as a senior manager at a very reputable contracting firm, FKJ Contractors, a position that I rose to in less than two years, having received three excellent awards. I do believe myself to be a one-man squad because I believe strongly in myself and I never ever leverage on the success of others. Mm. So I feel highly privileged to be here with your lovely family and really honored to be having this one-on-one -on -one conversation with you. But what I most cherish is how blessed you are to have such a beautiful, brilliant, calculating goddess as a daughter, whose fantastic philosophies to life I highly admire. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, I'm actually we're very glad that you accepted my invite. Thank you very much. Uh, please let's eat. Yeah. Bon appetit. <laughs> Sweetheart, well, the young man has quite impressive credentials. Uh -huh. uh, he's handsome. Yes. He's hard working. Uh -huh. And from what I see, uh, he's a good boy. Well. And he is humble and respectful. But there's something I, I can't quite put a finger on. I, I can't quite understand. My spirit still doesn't accept him. And I don't think I will allow him to have a relationship with my daughter. I don't think I will allow that. That's yes. Right. Yes, yes we had. Yes. Oh. I I am serious about what I'm saying. Yes. Honey. Mm. Why? Well, I, I don't feel very comfortable about him. I um, there's something I can't quite I can't quite put a finger on. So I wouldn't allow him to have any relationship with my daughter. <sighs> I just can't. I'm sorry, Dad. darling, but I can't. Dad. Yes. I, I'm sorry, I can't. Uh, I have to protect you. Uh, there's something, something my spirit is uh, against. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dear. I'm sorry. consider myself to be highly privileged if you both could be the father and the mother that I never had and if you could also shower on me the fatherly and motherly love that I have always craved for. Abuja Kaduna Road construction project. Okay, sit down. Thank you very much, sir. Such an awesome. 
Oh, here she is. Hi, daughter. How are you, darling? Okay, okay. sir, man, we'll, we'll be on our way. Now. That'll be good, it's okay. okay. Thank you very much. Okay. All right, take it easy, right? Have fun. I will. See you guys soon. Be careful. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Cynthia. Oh my God! You just said 
Your screen just cut off. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was carried away with uncontrollable excitement. <laughs> Granted me his blessings to go for the Abuja Cardinal Road contract. Oh my god! Dear mother! Yes. You are a blessed man! I know I am blessed. Please yes. say it again. You are a blessed I man! I am blessed, I know that. <laughs> but honestly speaking, yes. I cannot take all the glory. Because if not for your mentorship and the wise counsel you've been giving me, <laughs> I would not have made it this far. So I say thank you very much. You are welcome, you are welcome. Are you, you know what this contract to do for us, right? I know! I'm glad I invested in you! This calls for celebration. Let me get Oh, come on! Yeah, bring it off! Champagne! 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 Oh, my stuff! Cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers, good night, bro! Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. This sentence will officially be a married man. Oh, yeah, I would be a married man. I know what it means for me, but then. I know what, bro. My best man. Yes. I am so excited because everything is on point. Yeah. yeah. Let me tell you something that happened. Do you know that my wonderful and amazing father-in-law, Senator Chief Lucas, introduced me to all his friends who happen to be movers and shakers of this country. And in fact, some of them happen to be members on the board in the executive council that awards road contracts. Introduce me to them as a swap He told them what I do. <laughs> oh yes. Out of 15 of them who were present, 12 assured me of their vote. Ah, you will have this good news. I won't be for five years. Bro, by the time I win this contract, I was being on the road to becoming the managing director of FKJ Contractors. Hmm. Even my mentor is going to be from the same very Do you know what that means? I will be in control of the world of your fingers. I read the mother, chest to that. The mother, chest to that. Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Will you sing for me? Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? your body let me know you better let me hold your ways let me tell you daddy yeah. will you give so, me the key how far have you gone so silly oh sorry i have gone very far good because uh, in a couple of days the names of the uh, contracts our deals will be announced I do believe the right word to use is that the ball has been set rolling. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we both know the rules of the game very well. I would like to say that the ground where it's been played is in my domain. <laughs> <laughs> you can say that again. Well understood. Yes, sir. Because as it stands, so Mr. Lucas and his friends, the caliber of Mr. Lucas, are his friends behind you. Indomitable. I definitely am. Indomitable. <laughs> I definitely am. Yeah, all I had to do was to confirm. Oh, oh, that's 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 in sync as well because uh, conformity is a rule of the game when it comes to 
politics and contracts. Oh yes, it's the fundamental rule, foundational rule, <laughs> all over the world. You always say that. So I congratulate you in advance. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. So let, let me start. Let me go on my. Let me be on my way right now. No problem. No problem. I'll see you. Thank you, sir. Take care. All, right. all the best. Problem with the baby. Your parents and I will make sure the baby is well taken care of. But right now, I need to go somewhere so I can clear my head and find a solution to this problem. Babe, I need you.
it's like teaching a man how to fly and then you don't teach him how to fly. No. My dear, it's okay. I thought your father had given his total support. That's what I told as well. Please. We talk to father. I don't want to have issues in my marriage. It is either you crash or you become a puppet to your teacher and learn safely. The mother, this is a game. Just what are you the way you look right now? Yes, the mother. Listen, I put it to you. Mr. Lucas knows what he's doing. He wants you to look like a failure to sit there. Especially now that I'm expecting. <laughs> expecting a child? Good news! This is perfect! It's alright. Everything will be fine. He's my husband. I'll talk to him. Wipe your tears. Okay, pretty. <laughs> Wipe your tears. Give me a smile. I am so happy. So Cynthia can see uh, like a failure uh, and then abandon you. Oh, Mola. Something funny about him? Yes, uh, there's something I can't place a finger on. It, it's, it's just there. It's a, it, it's a nagging feeling. What, honey? You did a background check on this boy and found out that everything is true. He's a respectable young man. He's smart, he's intelligent, and he's a go getter. I know all that. All these don't matter to you. If not, you will not hesitate and give you your total support. Calm down, honey. Calm down. Calm down, sweetheart. Calm down. Things don't work that way. Honey. Please do this for them now that they expect a child. What? What did you say? They're expecting a child, a grandchild. They're expecting my grandchild. <sighs> okay. Do that tomorrow. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Thank you, love. I did that too. Thank you, I love okay, you. Thank you. Will you sing for me? Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Baby, smile for me. Me want to love you. Me want to love you. You want to kiss your body, you want to touch you, me want to love you. Hello? Baby, baby, please come home. We miss you. I am calling to give you a very important information. Babe, don't be like that, okay? Just come home and we can sort things out. Go to the living room. You'll find a flash drive there. Go through it. Now listen very carefully. Your father's votes will determine how the content of that flash drive will be treated. Babe, I know you're not happy. Why don't you come home? Let's talk about it like husband and wife. And. Babe? <laughs> you 
just be on standby. Very soon, a tornado is going to hit the Lucas family if they do not do as I have demanded. <laughs> Definitely. All right. Talk to Demola. Demola. This is a sex tape of me. Are you telling me or you're asking me? How? When did you do this? Irrelevant question. Did I even do wrong to deserve this? More irrelevant question. What am I supposed to do with this? The most irrelevant question. Now listen very carefully, my dear. Nothing is going to stop me from achieving my goal. If your father does not give me his votes, which happens to be the last vote needed for that contract to be awarded to my company, before 12 noon tomorrow, that sex leave would go viral. Do not dare me. How can you? How can you do this? man turn out to be callous oh so he's a wolf in sheep's clothing could it be what your dad sense from the onset ah! something we can discuss over the phone. Come right on.
this is preposterous. I knew it. I knew it. I knew there was something wrong with that young man. I, I, I couldn't put a finger on it. But you forced me. You forced me to accept that vermin, that idiot, that nobody. And you blackmailed me into allowing him marry my beautiful daughter. Who? What was he expecting to do? That is crazy. Yes, I'm sorry. Yeah. Honey, we didn't see him coming. Really? Honey, we can't watch him ruin our daughter's life. Oh, really? <laughs> Please, please do something, I beg you. What do you expect me to do? Tommy, please sign the document. I will never, ever sign it. I will never allow that young man black man. I can't. Daddy, <laughs> don't do this, please. For Cindy's sake, please. Please. On the books, your child has a lot to benefit in the future. So what? Please, so what? Mm. So what? Ah. So what? Never! I will never be blackmailed by a vermin, by an idiot, by that young man without pedigree, without a name. Never will that happen. <laughs> <laughs> who? Who would make a sex video of the wife? Who? Who could do that? Yeah, oh no. Yes. I need to see you face to face, yes. Um, yeah, a bit of a nasty situation. Someone is trying to play with my family. Okay, I'll come and see you. Sweetheart, you're dressed up. Yeah. Mom. Yes. Dad. Yes. I have decided not to sit here and cry my heart out. Why that bastard is busy killing my career and my life. I want to fight for What do you want to do? I want to release sex. Sit down. Release the sex tape of yourself? Do you know what that means? Mom, I know what it means. Relax, please. If I do this with what I have planned out, I will draw sympathy to myself. That way, I become the victim and him the villain. Yes, I'm going to go now. Sure, I have to go now. Yes, I'm going to go now. Be careful. some good news. That's really some good news. But let everybody just be on standby. Because once it clocks 12 noon, a very scandalous news will be all over the TV and social media platforms. <laughs> oh yes. Uh, let me call you back. My boss just came in. I'll be calling your office line all day. I wasn't picked up. Totally sorry, sir. I'm really sorry. Um, the thing is, I just I left the office to come to the lodge and try to clear my head. And just relax for a while. Oh, what's really going on? I mean, you're sitting so comfortably. How oh, oh, come? Oh, you're losing grip of our, of our plans. As it is, the votes have been counted. And by this time tomorrow, you may not will emerge for the road network construction contract nationwide. But you are here sitting so comfortably. <laughs> and uh, making calls for some press release as if you're 
you're some lord of an empire somewhere. I don't understand. I don't okay, get it. Please, please, sir. Just calm down. Everything is perfectly all right. I don't get it, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not feeling comfortable at all. Sir, believe me when I say everything is perfectly all right. I've got our plans covered. Really? Please, stop bothering yourselves, man. <laughs> because I thought uh, by now we should be seeing some members of the board, including uh, Mr. Lucas, who, who's been there for you. It's fine. He's sir. rooting for our company. It's okay, sir. It is properly handled the way it should. If you say so. Yes, sir. You are welcome to another special package of your mind-blowing live TV show, Dare to Speak Up. I am Sharon Eze, and today's special episode will blow your mind. Our special guest today is a beautiful woman with a heart of gold, who recently made a great mark in her career as a lawyer by winning one of the toughest cases of our time and getting justice for the downtrodden. She's also the daughter of a multi-million dollar business owner. And welcome with me, Cynthia. Please introduce yourself better and tell us your story. Thank you for having me. Um, my name is Cynthia Adekunle. I am the daughter of Mr. Lucas Akintola. I'm married to Mr. Dimola. Well, I fell in love with my husband. We're so in love. Yeah, it was like, what? And against what? all odds, it's going we got married. Wow. Well, you see, my husband, is a contractor and he was running for one of the contracts on the Abuja Kaduna Road. So before and after our marriage, my father introduced him to all his affluent friends, the politicians, even the senators. He finally introduced my husband to even the board of directors in charge of the road constructions in Nigeria. They all had a meeting and casted their vote for my husband. You see, I built my wall around my husband. I loved him. I respected him. I did everything that a woman would do to please his husband. Oh, well. One day my husband came home. So upset. I wondered what was making him so mad. <laughs> but he said that my father had refused to cast his own vote, which was the only vote left for him to be awarded the contract. I persuaded him. I begged him. I told him to be patient and everything will be okay. And we we're gonna sort it out. But no, he was so upset. They left the house. But when he did, he told me that he had dropped the drive for me and that I should watch. This drive here is what I want the world to see. As you can see in the video, my husband had paid two guys who dropped me and did a sex video of me so that everyone could think that I am a sex freak and a drug addict. Hmm. Well, he promised to make this video go viral by 12 noon today if my father does not cast his own votes. Whoa! Oh. Ready? I'm so pleased. That is my beloved. <laughs> yeah, so that is exactly the plan that 
I have for the Abuja Kaduna Road construction. I hope you've received the files now. Yes, yes. We'll make it one of a kind in Nigeria. Demon, now end that call this minute and check the social media platforms and see how you're in control. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, Mr. Dekulea Demola. One of the guys who you contracted to do one of those sex videos confessed. Oh, yes. You see, he's one of the elder brother of the girl who I fought for. And I won the case without even charging her a dime. Now I can see how you had everything covered. And why you have been stolen on all our plans. You mess up every hard work we put in place to get the contracts. Well, as you can see, Mr. Demola, I have enough evidence to put you in jail for the rest of your miserable life. How could you? You would try to blackmail your own wife, a lady who turned things around for your good, with her father's affluence and influence. And that of his friends. Are you some sort of demon or what? Demola Adekunle, you are finished. You have messed up every plan that we had in place. This action of yours, this barbaric action, is tantamount to wizardry. And I'm glad that I was never a part of it. Tell me, how can a man stoop so low to blackmail his own wife? How? This is my story. And thank you for having me on the show. This is such a touching story that everyone out there should learn from. It is appalling that a husband can do this to his wife, who just loved him and gave him a better state through the affluence of her family. I think wickedness runs in some people's veins rather than blood. Anyway, we'll go on a break right now. When we're back, we'll receive your reactions to her story. What are you doing over there, Pat? You're not happy. I'm not happy. Oh, of course I'm happy. I mean, I'm proud of her. You sure? Yeah. Okay, baby. So much, baby. Okay. Maybe that's her own way of showing her own happiness. Oh, 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 I, I can't wait for her to return to the house. I'm so, I'm so, so pleased. I am one of these. Thank you for your support, too. Thank you, girl. How can you go against the Lucas family? That is like going to the stream to fetch water with a basket. If you ever have a chance to start your life and career again, all over, I'm sure you will learn to do it right. I'm more than disappointed in you. Made us proud with what she did. Yes, stand up to that criminal. Mm -hmm. Yes, we must. Mm -hmm. oh. So you begin to plan it. Yeah, yeah, I will. Of course, she's yes. back. Oh! Cynthia! What was that for? That was for betraying me and the Lucas family. What are you talking about, sweetheart? Pat, what is going on? I don't know, Mom. You don't know? You don't know, really? Mom, yes. Dad. Well, 
It will interest you to know that this idiot has been working with Demala. What? What? <laughs> hmm. what? Oh Are you going to confess now before I pounce on you? Please. I'm sorry, girl. I want to. I'm so. Cindy, don't, please. Don't, okay? Please, please. please Sweetheart, please. don't do anything stupid. Okay. Start talking. The Mola and I were dating. Hmm? And then he asked me to introduce him to Cindy. Come on, baby. You know I'm doing this for us, right? You know that. I know. But it's insane. Alright, fine. Fine. I'll introduce you to Cindy. Use her and the family to get the contract. But after we should don't have to. Okay, fine. Baby, you have to promise me. What? Promise me that you can't do it. You won't leave me. My love. My darling. How is it possible that I would leave my heart? Is it possible? Don't you believe me? Huh? I can only promise you. Let me show you. Oh, yeah, baby, that is it. Oh, that feels good. Really good. Sweet, baby. Yeah. How's the plan going? Oh yeah, it's going great. Really great. Okay. I hope they are beginning to feel my impact in the house. Of course. <laughs> are you not the one and the only Dimola Dimola? Oh yeah, say my name again. Dimola. Say my name again. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's it. Mm. I love it, baby. What? What? We brought you into this family as a daughter. You often. We took you in at the age of eight. Showered you with so much love. People don't even know we're not your biological parents. How could you do this, oh, Pat? Sorry. Sorry? Oh my God. You just said sorry now. Shh. After all the love we showered on you in this house, we did all this. You are just a demon, that's what you are. Mom, yes. Please, I beg you to allow me. Do what I need to do now. Please, to win this family. Pat, okay. I leave this house. Yes. Okay. Where do you think you're going to? When? When you came into this house, you came with a ton screen uniform. Yet you had the heart to backstab me, right? Now you will leave this house with nothing. You will leave the same way you came. Leave if I kill you! Now get out! Get out! You bloody wretched girl. The world is a terrible place. Bad man can hear oh, she already know. I be one man mopo, come on my own. Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Will you sing for me? Would you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Baby, smile for me. Me want to love you. Me want to love you. Me want to kiss your body. Me want to touch you. Me want to love you. Yeah, me want to love you. Me want to touch your body. Me want kiss you, baby. You oh, ah, ah. give me special kind of feeling. Girl, I want to love you like like Titi la oh, oh. Baby, give me what we want. Let me take you out, closing you. You touch my body, spirit, soul, and body. You make me whole once again, oh. Baby, for your love. 
I go cross any mountain Just for your love, I go do anyhow, yeah. Let me touch your body, let me know you better Let me hold your waist, let me tell you daddy yeah. Will you give me the keys to your heart if you love me? Will you hold me down? Will you sing for me? Would you give me the keys to your heart when you love me? Will you hold me down? Will you smile for me? Me one love you. Yeah, me one love you. Me one kiss your body. Me won't touch you. 